It's Phil the Handyman up here in Northern California. How you all doing today? How you all doing today? Well, I finally broke down and got a brand new master cylinder. And put her in. Basically, what I did, uh, I was able to uh, go to the hardware store and get me some, uh, some plastic tubing. And of course you have to prime these. And so basically there's little plugs in here. I stuck the tubes in the plugs and stuck them around back inside, filled the uh, container up and pushed the plunger on the uh, on the brake and I primed it. I got probably 90% of the bubbles out of it. And uh, so that did not solve my problem. And by the way, thanks a lot for you guys. Be, I think it's BA, BWN Distributing in Florida. Uh, selling on eBay. I got this uh, brand new master cylinder for it was about 50 bucks. And so thanks a lot guys for that one. And so anyway, uh, yeah, so I put that in, started up, and still had the problem. So I went around and looked at the wheel cylinders again. And that's something I didn't see. Something I didn't see before. But this wheel cylinder here is leaking. That tire looks a little low by the way too. You look up in there and you can see that wheel cylinder's soaked. And then I looked down here and I saw it down there. And you can't see anything over there. None of the other ones have any problems except for this one. I think actually, I'm thinking this one went out a couple years ago too. I don't know why this one keeps going out. Uh, I think the last one I got from AutoZone. And I'm going to be buying this one from AutoZone. The wheel cylinder is only 8 bucks from AutoZone. And O'Reilly was, was something like, uh, I don't know, 15 or 20 bucks. So, and then I also got new shoes for this one. So I'm going to put new shoes on these. But right now, I'm just going to, uh, I'm just going to uh, see if I can put this back together. Um, so that uh, I can drive it for a little while. And what I want to do is I want to put new gear oil on some of these other parts that this is probably original gear oil. I want to put new transmission oil on this thing. And so, first thing I got to do is jack this puppy up, take this wheel off, and take a look in here and see uh, see what that wheel cylinder looks like. Okay, so it's looking pretty bad. Uh, luckily, I've got the brake clean, and we're going to clean it up. But it's leaking out of this side of the wheel cylinder. You can see it. What I'm going to try and do is, probably not much I can do with it. The the uh, the new cylinders are coming tomorrow. Um, I got a pickup I'm supposed to do here pretty quick, but uh, what I can do is I can adjust these out and uh, see if I can make it work that way. But otherwise, we'll have to put a new cylinder on here. I don't think there's much I can do with this. I might be able to pound it in a little bit that way and adjust it out. Of course, you have to adjust it with the uh, hub on so you get the uh, correct action.